book review. Uh, this book review is When We Were Bouncers 2 uh, by Paul Lazenby. Um, I've, I've reviewed the first one in a previous clip. I suggest you check it out. Again, love this guy's books, love this guy's work. Um, if you don't know Paul Lazenby, shame on you. Uh, years and years and years ago, just to clean it on to the type of cool guy that he is, um, I did I did a little bit of work for a, a website called JustSportsLife.com. I don't think it exists anymore. Uh, and I couldn't pay people for the interviews because I didn't have any money. Paul was one of the first guys on the bus route, Guy Mesco, who allowed me to interview him completely for free. He was very open. Um, if I can find the interview, I'll link it. I know I've sent a, a version of it to him recently. Super cool guy, super cool book. Uh, I hope there's more from his When We Were Bouncers series. Um, can't recommend it highly enough. Really, really enjoy it. He, if you're not familiar with the One Will Bouncers books, basically Paul Lazenby interviews a bunch of people who are now famous, who at one point or another in their lives were bouncers. Throughout both series of books, he's interviewed such guys as Henzo Gracie, Ken Shamrock, uh, Chris Jericho, a whole bunch of other guys that you might know at Tate Fletcher. A lot of people... Uh, who might surprise you that they once worked as, as bouncers, doormen, door supervisors, whatever the official terminology is in your area. Uh, again, well worth getting a copy of the book. Um, it's well worth reading. You won't be disappointed. It's entertaining as hell. Uh, as Stone Cold Steve Austin in the introduction and the foreword to this book says, he's only read four full books in his life. I think well, it might be that year. I think it's four full books in his life. This is one of them. That should tell you what you need to know. When we're bouncers too, Paul Lazenby, go get it.